Hi everybody, I'm Mrs. Hillary and to help you celebrate Black History Month, we are going to read another story from the book Little Legends, Exceptional Men in Black History by Vashti Harrison. Today we will read about Leland Melvin. Leland was born in 1964 and he was an astronaut. Leland didn't grow up wanting to be an astronaut. He watched the moon landing on TV with his family, but didn't see anyone who looked like him. So he never even considered wanting that for himself. He did grow up wanting to be like Arthur Ashe, the star athlete who had trained five blocks from where Leland grew up in Lynchburg, Virginia. Around the time he started playing sports, he got his first chemistry set and accidentally burned a hole in the carpet. He was amazed at how powerful chemicals could become once they were mixed. While on a football scholarship at the University of Richmond, Leland majored in chemistry. His classmates couldn't believe he was both an academic and an athlete. After graduation, he was drafted into the National Football League. Unfortunately, he damaged a hamstring in training camp. It could have been the end of Leland's dreams, but his other love, science, was calling. Leland got a job at NASA Langley Research Center while earning his master's degree at the University of Virginia. At Langley, a friend suggested that he apply to become an astronaut. He was accepted on his first try. Being a candidate didn't mean he was automatically got going to go to space though. He went into training and again, he was injured. He was in the neutral buoyancy lab a big pool of water meant to simulate the feeling of space when he suffered ear damage that left him partially deaf and unfit for space flight. This didn't make him any less of an astronaut. For several years, he worked at the Johnson Space Center in Houston and visited schools to talk about NASA. After some healing, he learned that he had been reapproved for flight. In 2008, on the space shuttle Atlantis, he flew into space on the 24th mission to the International Space Station. Through football, Leland learned perseverance and teamwork, and through his career as a scientist and as, a, as an astronaut, he learned patience and adaptability. In his life, he found that no plan is fixed, but that hard work and dedication allowed him to reach new heights.